NBC 15 News starts now. Hello and thank you for joining NBC 15 News on the Web. I'm Christine Belport. Here are the stories we're following for you today. We have new information this morning. A manhunt for a suspect in a fatal shooting in West Allis ended with a chase and shootout near DeForest. Police say a 42-year-old man was fatally shot yesterday morning at an apartment complex in West Allis. Several hours later, a drive-by shooting was reported on I-9094 in Sauk County. The interstate then was shut down in both directions for several hours. Police ended up opening fire after the 20-year-old driver refused to drop his gun. He was taken to the hospital. We do not know the extent of his injuries, but police believe he did know the 42-year-old man who was killed in West Allis. It is not a, a random crime. There is a connection, we believe, between the suspect and the apartment building. Two passengers in the car were also taken into custody. A teenager is in custody after a woman was attacked in Janesville. Police were called to the 400 block of North Main Street after 6 last night. Officers found a 23-year-old woman who had been attacked. She said she was jogging in an area along the river when she was attacked and robbed. Police officers found a 15-year-old who matched the description given by the victim, so he's being held at the Rock County Juvenile Detention Center. And finally, a barn in Westport is deemed a total loss after a fire. Several fire departments responded to the fire on the 6,000 block of River Road around 10 yesterday morning. Damage is estimated to be worth more than $100,000. The fire, they say, was likely caused by machinery in the barn. Thankfully, though, no animals were injured. Those are the stories we're following for you today. Go out and make it a great day.